Hello again. In this video, we're going to talk about the relationship between your gallbladder and your eyes, okay? Um, I've had some patients come in in the past that noticed when they had their gallbladders out, their vision went down. And the reason for that is that vitamin A is a fat-soluble vitamin, okay? Um, it supports the membranes that surround the eye and also the membranes on the inside of the eyelid itself. It supports the cornea, which is the trans parent front part of the eye. It also decreases the risk of certain types of infection on the eye. It prevents night blindness. Also, it prevents dry eyes and prevents ulcers. Now, carotenoids are a pro-vitamin A or a pre-vitamin A that will turn into the active form called retinol, but these are in plants like kale, spinach, and leafy greens. This is also fat soluble. And it's great to support the macula and prevent macular degeneration, which is a little part of the back part of the retina. Now, if someone doesn't have a gallbladder or they don't have enough bile because the gallbladder is congested or it's sluggish, they're not gonna actually be able to break down the fat soluble vitamins, uh, specifically vitamin A and carotenoids, and eventually it's going to affect the eyes. So the gallbladder is a little sac that concentrates bile, okay, like up to 20 times. So when you eat, it contracts, it squeezes out, and it starts to dissolve and break down some of these foods, uh, specifically the, the fats uh, that have, that contain the vitamin A. And then the pancreas releases an enzyme called lipase, which takes that particle and breaks it down even further, so they work together. So there is a situation where you can have a pancreatic deficiency of enzymes, and it's not really the gallbladder. That's another possibility. Um, but most common thing is the gallbladder because so many people have those removed and then they have issues. Now, if someone doesn't have a gallbladder or they have some sluggishness, you can get uh, some purified bile salts to assist in the breakdown of vitamin A and these carotenoids. So we just have to determine, is the problem not enough vitamin A in the diet or is it a lack of absorption? Um, some of the gallbladder symptoms are right shoulder pain, headaches, constipation because bile lubricates the colon, uh, bloating when you're eating, like you're driving at night and you can't quite see in the dark, you're squinting, or uh, sinus problems because it affects the inside of the mucous membranes, or dry eyes, or any additional symptom that might relate to vitamin A deficiencies. And go ahead and comment below and tell me if you've ever had any of the symptoms from vitamin, either a vitamin A deficiency or a gallbladder deficiency. Thanks for watching. Hey, I appreciate your attention, and if you're enjoying these videos, Go ahead and subscribe and I will definitely keep you updated on future events, live events, and webinars that we're going to do very soon.